Hey, I'm awesome, and you're not okay. so awesome. This is cream Welcome pie. to Trollcraft. Fun to play with, not to eat. So how, how, out of interest, how how do you plan on leveling up the uh, the Magikarp we did catch? Are you going to wear candy in? Up to you. Or... It's your Pokemon. You wanted the Magikarp. You you choose. I don't care. I just think a Gyarados would be good to have. And that's that's how we'll do it. Okay. Well, so how do you want to do it? Let's do a five-hour grinding session. <laughs> All right. Well, watch. All right, everyone. Uh, we're gonna do a screen pan as soon as I pull out magic card. Let me just go ahead and get in front of this. What's happening here? You don't need to look at what's happening behind me. You can just Dude, pay attention. To me. So Gyarados is pretty well hidden. I mean, you'd have to level up your level five magic card <laughs> quite a bit before he turned into a Gyarados. Yeah. You know what a uh, shiny Magikarp and Gyarados look like, right? Yeah, shiny Gyarados looks like a shrimp. He's like red, yeah. Oh, wait. Oh, no, no. I'm thinking of something else, maybe. Gyarados is red, and Magikarp is gold. Like, like he's made of money. <laughs> he's made of money, yeah. Do you remember the episode in the anime where James got, like, ripped off? No. Someone charged him 500 for it, and they spray painted a Pokeball gold. They're like, this rare Pokemon. James oh, buys okay. it and sends it out, and it's a Magikarp, and he's like, stupid Magikarp. He like kicks it, yeah. and like and then it evolves. It's funny. And Into like Gyarados. Yeah. I was like, I was thinking of Mega Gyarados. <laughs> oh yes, Mega Gyarados. All right, Kafka is evolving. Oh. <gasps> Wonder what he's gonna evolve into. After all of our hard work. <laughs> there he Asparanos. is, Gary. Gary Oak. Gary Oak. So okay, we can go this way and get a ground type to deal with um. Ground. Well, remember, we're having issues with electric types. Yeah. So, if we... I think this is a cave here. Route 11. <laughs> you need to ground the current. Is that I what think, it is? Yeah. Alright, we're in Diglett Cave. <laughs> uh, that's kind of funny. I wonder if that was intentional. That probably yeah, is. Probably. probably. Well, it isn't... Isn't this a surprise? Diglett dug this cave. And it's like pitch fucking black down there. Oh, not apparently not in this game. Apparently not. Wait, are we going right, to Viridian encounter. City? Oh, no, we're going back up. All right, here's our encounter. Diglett's not bad. No, Doug he's trio's the ground type cool. we needed. We're on the road to Viridian, Viridian City. City. We're making friends along the way. Could have called him Manlet. That's fine. We could do that, but I was doing Dicklet. That's, it's your turn. Because Diglet, Dicklet. Because he kind of he has a sort of phallic quality. Yeah, about exactly, him. exactly. Like, because I'm the first person to make that joke. Well, I'll just be like an. You honest. probably are. I mean. I yeah, I probably am. I'm original. I think. We're mostly good to go. Alright. We need cut, but to get cut, we have to go on the SSN, which means mm. we should probably heal up real quick, and then, because that's going to be a pain in the ass. Because you don't fight the guy till you're already kind of low. Should you buy, like, potions or paralyze heals we or got antidotes potions. or something? We, we don't have to, I don't think we'll be worrying about poison and stuff. If we were fighting bugs, yeah, but we're going on a boat with a bunch of rich people. Gonna maybe have like one just in case, because we are doing a Nuzlocke. Kyle, nothing <laughs> bad would be ever cautious. happen. Nothing bad would ever happen. Uh, Paralyze heal. We don't have to worry too much about awakening. If we have an awakening, we can just switch them out. Okay. Same with ice. I'm not too concerned. The only reason I'm kind of concerned about ice is because we have flying types, and a, and mm. Gyarados is also a flying type, so we have a lot of flying types on our team. Uh huh. So I guess I'll take two. Birds. Yeah, you know Gyarados, the famous bird. He is famous. Wait, is he a flying type? Yeah, he's a flying type, not a dragon. That's weird. Yeah. 
Just like Charizard. Not a dragon, but a flying type. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'll show you. But even though he's the most dragon-looking Pokemon I think there is. Yep. <laughs> See, he water flying. Huh. Look. Look how awesome this giant cruise ship is. Look at how tiny that toy boat is. <laughs> no, it's huge and big. As you can boat, clearly tell boat, from the toy outside. Boat, toy boat, toy boat, toy boat. You might be challenged by the more bored ones. Bonjour, I am le waiter on the ship. I'll be happy to serve you anything you please. Ah, uh, le strong silent type. Do you like yeah. my French accent? Yes. Yeah. Le, le eggs on le. <laughs> Yo, mon petit, mon petit. We're busy here. We are busy Out here. Way. Out of the way. Whoa. Patrick Star. Uh -huh. mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm sure nobody makes that joke. No one's ever made that joke. Probably never. Would we're the, we're joke. original and smart and creative. Definitely. And really cool and really hot and people really like us and and we have a lot of friends of people who really like spending time with us. All right, last last guy on this floor. <laughs> Why are you saying that like you don't? Because <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> oh, a stranger, I couldn't tell if you're from the seas or mountains, but stop and chat. All my Pokemon are from the sea, which means all of them are going to be one shot. Yo, it's Barney. Of that beer I own, told you. What? Nothing. No, I just couldn't even understand what like you were actually physically saying. I said about that beer I owed you. About that beer. I heard Ephesus oh yeah. It's because it's Barney. Mmm, of course. Half-Life reference. See, that's why I got it. Because you're talking to me, the Half-Life guy. That is what you've been called. <laughs> they, the I can't believe- guy. Why do they keep calling me that? I don't- I mean, it must be- because of your encyclopedic knowledge of Half-Life. Possibly. Ooh, I want to trick the trash. A Hyper Potion in the trash, let's go. Hmm. I want to find PP up. See, people always criticize me for going through other people's garbage when they're like not at their house or asleep or something, but yep. I tell you, it's really profitable. Yeah, people don't get it. You never know what you might find. A critical hit. He died. He did die. I'm killed by a rat. <laughs> In particular, Rathio, a famous gentleman. Yeah. Oh yes, a Growlithe. Of course, it makes sense I'm that if I, beat, if I beat your first one, I clearly won't beat your second one. The implication is that this guy just has like a bunch of fancy dogs on leashes or something yeah. that he's like walking around with them. <laughs> yeah, probably. Yeah. These are my fancy dogs. They're naturally bred. Naturally bred. That's kind of a contradiction, isn't it? What's the what's the term? Uh, like purebred. Oh yeah. <laughs> naturally bred. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just want to give a uh, water pulse to Gyarados. Hmm. He learned it. He had to go through a lot of pain. Did you see that shaking? Yes? Oh my god, like... I didn't... Wait, we just healed all of our Pokemon here. Oh, really? Good to fucking oh, know. Alright, this is... I like this lady. Alright, remember that room. <laughs> She's like the Nuzlocke queen. <laughs> the... <laughs> our Nuzlocke queen. Fuck all. Look, it's doing, like, fucking, like, at most, like, two damage. Well, he's dead, so... Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, but you got poisoned. I told you! It's fine, we can go rest. And I, I I do, I have it bought, but we can go rest, like, super easily. You, you were like, no, rich people, you're not gonna have any bugs. <laughs> they don't have bugs. They have another poison but type, look, apparently. But look, you still got poisoned! I did get poisoned, huh? I can't believe I'm always right. Network. I love always being right. 
You were wrong. No, I was you right. Were I can't believe Kyle. I, I've been telling you we needed potions. And you're like, ah, oh, don't spend the money. And you're like, I, I was like, Kyle, we need to spend the potions. You remember that? You remember that conversation? I'm not gaslighting you. Wait, hold on. Notices gas fired lamp on the side of the room. Oh shit! Oh, God. Uh, don't don't look over there. Okay. Uh, you put that there. What is you that? That, there. You put that, that light there. source looks like it's being powered by some kind of gas, and it's yeah. illuminating the room. Yeah, you put in the gas light. So, um. Wait, so another one just appeared. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, there's another poison type. Hey Kyle, look, there's another poison type. Nice. Remember what I told you? We'd be fighting so many. You know, there's a lot of, like, kerosene lamps appearing in my room. It's really strange. Yeah, I mean, it, it, that happens. Oh, water pulse. I guess it's nothing. Yeah, it's nothing. Don't even look over there. It's fine. Don't look at the other one that was just added. No, that, because wait, that wasn't gaslighting, so another one didn't appear. Yes, it was. <laughs> Now I want to be. <laughs> that was good. No, that was good. That's like a real joke. <laughs> it was like it was like a real joke. It wasn't a real joke. It was like it though. <laughs>